welcome. I'm Tamison Baker, and today I'm talking all about mobile-first indexing. What it is, how it works, and how to make the most of it for your business. Tell me more. First and foremost, what is mobile-first indexing? It is, as the name implies, the preference of mobile websites in Google's search algorithm. Google knows that the trend of users viewing more content from their phones is here to stay, and mobile-first indexing reflects that. So what does that mean for you as a business owner? And is simply having a mobile version of your website good enough? Let's dive into this world of indexing a little deeper. I'm so ready. Mobile-first indexing means that the mobile version of your website is the starting point and baseline for how Google determines your rankings. But it's not mobile only, meaning that if your website doesn't have a mobile version, your desktop version will instead be the starting point. Just keep in mind that not having a mobile site could likely have a negative impact on your rankings overall. I don't like that. I don't like the sound of it. Something else to consider is that mobile-first indexing means that your mobile site will be the primary version of your website. Up until now, the desktop version of your site was considered the primary version. So if your mobile site is just as good as your desktop site and both have been equally optimized, you've got nothing to worry about. But if your mobile site is more bare bones, isn't built responsibly, or hasn't been optimized with things like speed and SEO in mind, you may want to consider some fine tuning to help your rankings. So what should you do about mobile-first indexing? First off, don't panic. Okay, it's happening! Everybody stay calm! What's the Everybody procedure, everyone? Calm. What's the procedure? This change is still in the early stages of planning and is being rolled out very gradually. But there are a few tweaks to consider as you ready your business's online presence for the shift. When it comes to context, text that is collapsed or hidden within tabs will not be treated any differently than otherwise visible content. Because you're operating with less space on mobile, this kind of setup is actually more ideal. So all content will be treated equally regardless of its placement on the site. If you have a specifically designed mobile website separate from your desktop version, you want to make sure that the content is just as high quality and valuable, including things like alt tags or indexable videos and images. You want to include the same structured data markup on both versions of your site, and make sure that your titles and meta descriptions are equivalent on both versions of all pages. If you're using Creflang for internationalization, your mobile URL's Creflang annotations should point to the mobile version of your country and language variants, and desktop URLs should point to the desktop versions. Your social metadata, like Twitter cards, should be included in both versions, and you'll want to make sure that any links to sitemaps are also accessible from the mobile version of your site. Make sure you verify the mobile version on the Google Search Console, verify that your host servers can handle the increased crawl rate, and consider implementing mobile switchboard tags. If you say so. Sound like a lot? Here at CS Design Studios, we have the qualified team and the know-how to get every version of your website optimized for this new mobile-first indexing. For more information, please visit our website at csdesignstudios.com.